Now, first alert weather with Chief Meteorologist Tom Messner. Many of us looking at a clear sky tonight. This is Burlington where things are getting a little bit chilly. It is 38 degrees in the city right now. In fact, 30s all over the weather map from the Northeast Kingdom to the Upper Valley, back into the Champlain Valley, even over toward well, as you get into the Seaway Valley, 27 degrees, a little bit colder in the Tri Lake. So temperatures coming down tonight. It is going to be frosty for many of us by the beginning of tomorrow, but right in the Champlain Valley, there's a frost advisory because we haven't seen that much ice yet and the growing season kind of hanging on by a thread. But the bottom line is this goes till nine o'clock in the morning and it is going to be cold when you get up first thing tomorrow. All right, I, I mentioned that a lot of us have a clear sky out there. We'll check it out. Take you down to the south where we've got the remnants from what was Tropical Storm Nestor. This thing dropping a whole bunch of rain. The good news is it continues to move. It'll affect us just a little bit. Hold that thought for just about 10 seconds. We've got a front back to the west. This is coming our way. This is what is going to drop a little bit of rain on us later on Tuesday and into Tuesday night. Let's go back to Nestor, show you where this is going. OK, so 1 o'clock tonight and then through the overnight into tomorrow. The actual moisture, the rain itself stays south of us. We do get clipped with a bunch of clouds and then the clouds get on out of here. So we've got a fine looking Monday after some clouds tomorrow. It's Tuesday when the rain is going to arrive coming in from the west. So partly sunny first thing tomorrow, more clouds. I'm thinking by the afternoon because of what was the tropical storm. So let's look ahead. This is future cast. We'll take you through the overnight and here comes your tomorrow. Tomorrow's going to be fine for a while. I think we find more clouds around by later in the day because of the system that is going to stay south of us over in the St. Lawrence Valley. I think you guys end up with more sunshine than everybody else, but right around the Champlain Valley to the south off to the east, it gets cloudy by a little bit later on in the afternoon and then this all leaves. Monday is looking good. We end up with a lot of sunshine that day, but then that night and into Tuesday. That's when that system comes in from the west. This is later on Tuesday afternoon getting into evening time. Here comes the rain possibly affecting a lot of us for the evening commute. Again, that's Tuesday and we'll keep an eye on that for you. First alert weather for tonight, mainly clear, some patchy frost really everywhere. That does include the Champlain Valley lows for most in the 30s, some 20s, Northeast Kingdom and also the Adirondacks. Partly sunny tomorrow. I think the sunniest area is over toward Messina. Then we've got afternoon clouds as you come on off to the east. Burlington 59, 57 in Johnson. We'll take you down to the south where we do have more afternoon clouds around. Poultney 57 degrees. Same thing in Bellows Falls. Stratton just a little bit cooler at 52. So Sunday we've got more clouds in the afternoon. It is going to be a dry day though. 59, 63 on Monday. I think we end up with a decent amount of sunshine that day. Clouds thickening up too. Tuesday, some showers by later in the afternoon into that evening and the beginning of Wednesday. Then we get rid of this stuff. So Thursday is looking good. Friday, Saturday, chance for showers. But the following day, a week from tomorrow, it looks dry at this point. 